Hello, this is Cindy. Welcome to my channel and to a somewhat surprise video. I did not expect to be doing this. This was a, a surprise to me as well. So, some backstory. Uh, I have been going to some stamping up classes for about a year now and Nancy Burt Priest runs them. I will put a link to her channel down below because one of the things that she does that I really like she does a video of the card that she's going to make. Uh, every All the cards that she makes for the month, she makes a video for them and puts them up so that you can see the various cards. And um, this was one that we made. This is a thank you card. We made this one this time, which was very cute. But this one, don't be surprised if you see this in a fun fold Friday at some point. It just comes up like that. And this was a happy fall card. And so anyway, we make the cards and we have a good time and whatnot. But she's, and we always have these and I keep these because you know that that's going to get used. I get grid paper like that, you know that's going to get used. But this is what I'm here for. So the last time we met, I said, you know, you have all these scraps. You should save me the scraps of all the things that you're doing so that because I use them in my journaling. So when I got there this time, she brought me this whole bag and I can't wait to go through it and see what's here. So let's take a peek. OK, I have this this string of pink that is I am going to just kind of cut that because. I will end up cutting that all over everything. So there's some pretty blue ribbon here. And she said a lot of these are discontinued colors and whatnot. Not that I care. That's a really pretty blue. Some nice little... Oh yeah, that'll, those will be pretty to play with. Okay, what else is here? Ooh, I have some stamping up uh, brads. But these, I don't, these are a different kind of bread. Oh, look at that. It's like a gemstone bread. There's a, a red and an orange. I hope that's coming up on the color. Um, what is this one? Is it the same as the others? I have some black and white ones. Oh, that's yellow. And there's a single one over here green. Oh, th Nancy, thank you for these. This is going to be a lot of fun to play with. Okay, we have some ribbon here. This looks like a pretty mauve. I'm going to roll it back up because that will go in with my pink ribbons. And there's actually quite a bit of it that has come off the spool. I don't know that all of this, this is uh, actually stamping up ribbon as well. So I will be happy to use that. I, in fact, the next journal that I'm going to be working on after I get back after my vacation will be a blue and pink. Um, it's kind of a, I guess it's, I'm going to call it a shabby chic again. I'm really enjoying these. Okay, there is some. I don't, that's kind of a nice blue with a darker blue. Just, kind of, just look at all this ribbon. Okay, oh, that's elastic. Whee! <laughs> just let that fly around a little bit. Okay, what do we got here? So this is a brown. That'll be nice in a fall journal. I have been collecting stuff for another fall journal, so I probably will work on that as well. But there's that. What else do we have here? There's a couple more ribbon box, uh, ribbon spools. This is, oh, I could have used this in my yellow journal. I just finished that yellow journal. I might go back and add a little bit of this to it because I've already done the video and whatnot. So don't be surprised if you see this, however. If you buy that, I've got a journal that'll be, it's, it's uh, going live on uh, the 9th of October. Okay, this is a Valentine's star-shaped punch. Paper punch. Okay, we'll play with that, I'm sure. Okay, we have some cream-colored ribbon here. A lot of ribbon ends. 
which are great because then I don't mind using them up. It's kind of like, okay, what can I get rid of? How can I use stuff? Oops. Oh, these were some pieces that from our recent session. Okay, we have more blue ribbon here. I'm going to take that out and see what we have. Okay, that's a black and white gingham. That's cool. Here's some more of that pretty white. There's a couple of those. I'll put those over with that. There's a little green. And a different kind of blue. This is... Okay, that's a solid blue, and that's a blue with a border. Neat. Okay, we'll put those over there. What do we have here? Okay, I'm not going to take this one out of the packaging, because there are several... Oh, well, maybe I will, because there are several here. Okay, this is twill tape. I haven't done a lot with twill tape before, so we'll see about what we're going to use this for. If you have ideas for the twill tape, please put them in the comments. Give me some ideas on how to use this stuff. I mean, I've seen it as seam binding before, but how else can we use twill tape in the journals? Might make a nice um, closure. And that's more of the same. All right. Ooh, that'll be nice for Christmas. Christmas journals are coming. You know that that's going to happen soon. Okay, I don't... Oh, there's some more of that. Okay, this came all off of here. That's really cool. There's a lot of it. I'm not going to try to bundle it up right now. I have a string taut, caught to it. But those look cute. That'll also be pretty for Christmas. I'm going to put the two Christmas thingies together up here on my piles. All right, what else do I have? I have more blue. And the bags don't surprise me. This For the classes, she often pre-cuts things um, to make ribbons out of them. And she puts them in the bags and then just brings them to class. <gasps> more brads. More brads. This is wonderful. Are these the same type of brads? Oh, there's a larger green and smaller blue. Oh, these are going to be so much fun to play with and to put in my journals. That's a lavender. Okay, this is wonderful. Those are just absolutely marvelous. Okay, what are these? Oh, okay, these are... I see what these are. I, embellishment, adornment, I'm not sure what you want to call them, but basically it's a brad and you can put a, see you put that on top of it and now it makes something fancy. Okay, yeah, those are going into my new fancy journal too. Okay, more ribbon. We've got some yellow ribbon. She's got so much ribbon in here. We have some more twill tape. We have pink twill tape. And we have just a little bit. I was. She said she used to throw this stuff out. I said, I'm so glad that you have kept it for me. Instead, don't throw it out. Don't ever throw it out. Oh, that's going to be really neat. We have... Uh, this is also kind of like a twill tape. It's a ribbon. The, the pink and the black stripes. Okay. I'm just getting to the end of this. Okay, what do I have here? What, this is a piece that is attached. We will uh, um, wind that up later. That's black. We have some pink. We have some pink. We have some more of that white. And we have, I'm trying to find the end. There we go. There's the end of the gold. There is paper in here. Believe it or not, it's not just ribbons. We have some ribbon pieces here some oh lots and lots of ribbon pieces look at them all i love that color that's a really pretty color a little bit more a little bit more a little bit more and then we have some paper oh, there's some more ribbons we have the ends of some papers what are these oh i wonder if she meant to put those in there I love the needles. I, I use the needles when I'm putting the 
journals together. Just a couple of odds and ends of papers, which will be good to use. Okay, that's the bottom of my of the big bag, so we'll get rid of that off the table. Because then there's this whole bag. We're not done. Oh my god, she gave me so much ribbon. So many ribbon scraps. She said she's been just putting them in a bag. That's another needle. I am going to put the needle in here with this, and I'm going to double check with her and see if she meant to give me her needles. I don't know if she did. Okay, what do we have here? So we have a yellow, and we have a blue and green and brown that is has come loose. Of course, I don't know why I'm going to put it up on this one. I'm going to only change it over to one of my other playing cards, I think, probably. But then we've got this. We have pieces stuck here. There, oh, that is a really pretty satiny green. It's the same color as this one. We've got little pieces here of yarn. Those will be pretty as uh, toppers, you know, to tie around the topper thingies. I'll put those right over with my other ones. Um, what do we have here? Fancy fibers. Oh, those will be cool to play with. Ah, oh, I'm just so excited. This is just all this cool stuff. Nancy, you are a doll. This is so cool to have all of these pieces to play with. And you're going to see them and how they, how I do play with them. This is Stampin' Up! Fibers, Fancy Fibers. Uh, more Fancy Fibers. More Fancy Fibers. And more Fancy Fibers. Look at these. Look at them all. So, yeah, we'll play with a bunch of that. We've got some ribbon here and more fibers here. And I've got another thing of ribbon in here that's hiding just a little bit. What's on this one? Oh, this is that yellow. Oh, my glory. Look at all this stuff. I am going to have some fun playing with all of this. All right. If you are enjoying these videos, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and click the like button to let YouTube know that you like them. And um, I am still on vacation when you are watching this. This was a surprise video because this was a surprise gift. And um, you can thank Nancy for this by going to her channel, subscribing to her channel as well. I'll put that link down below. Uh, in the meantime, this is Cindy signing off.